Hey, hello, and welcome back to Good Knit Kisses. I'm your host, Kristen, and today is um, Tuesday, and I am super late on jumping in on my live videos. You guys have um, hopefully missed me. I have missed you, and uh, I have been moving the last um, week and a half, two weeks or whatever, <laughs> finalizing this new house, and we are in. We had... Um, we moved all last week, and then there was a four-day weekend with the kids, which kind of made it like ooh, even harder to do, so it's been crazy, and I finally got like a good night's rest last night. I went ahead and just slept in and didn't even worry about trying to get on at 8.30 like I normally do, so Tuesday, loom knitting day. I don't have any looms to share with you, but I really needed to jump on and say hi, so hi, everyone. And I was gonna tell you what's going on. And um, I also have a sweet present. This is a Christmas present sent to me by a viewer, Amber. And I can't wait to open it up. It's been my goal. So now I'm at a point where my studio is pretty much ready. I'm gonna start filming tomorrow. And um, I'm like, she has been my goal. I've been messaging her. I'm like, Amber, I wanna make sure that you can watch me, but also this is, you are my goal because it's like this sweet spot. I've been like, I've set her gift over in the corner and I'm like, I want to open this thing as my thank you to yay I did it <laughs> or whatever you know, me talk hey Amber I'm so glad you're here hi I see you jumped on hey everybody I'm gonna say hello Bridget missed you girl hi <laughs> hey Linnell hi and Gayla howdy hey Brenda good afternoon I know we're already in the afternoon already is that crazy I know I'm several hours late I apologize of course if you're watching me on the replay I'm right on time. <laughs> so thank you for joining me. I'm kind of waiting. I've got this little drum roll here. As you can see, I am not in my studio. If you watched my silly, goofy, funny video the other day, I had all the pretty yarn behind me um, right now. Okay, so we had a four-day weekend with the kids, and then today I have a sick kid. <laughs> and my heart didn't give me trouble. As many people have been sending me messages and thank you and prayers. Um, <clears throat> your prayers work because I didn't have any heart issues during the move. But today, of all days, it has been causing me trouble. I've been trying to chill out. <laughs> so, I don't know what's going on. So, I'm still waiting on that old and that MRI now that the New Year has happened and anything. Anyway, so trying to get all those things uh, settled. Um, thank you for joining me. Yeah, I missed you too, Bridget. Hey, Joanne. <laughs> yeah, I'm back. Um, you just got home from work, Gayla? That's awesome. So I am going to open this up. I, um, I've super been looking forward to it. Um, first, I want to tell you all, be looking out for um, videos that come from me. From They're actually going to be featured on the Yarnspirations YouTube channel as well as on my own YouTube channel. So if you haven't uh, joined uh, Yarnspirations YouTube channel, be sure and do that and uh, follow it so you get the emails uh, when they come up. Um, you can sign up for their newsletters. Go to Yarnspirations.com and check that out. And I have got my sample for the first video um, we're going to be working with Bernat uh, Softy Chunky yarn. I know that the image is flipped, but this is a Softy Chunky. You can't see the color, but it's emerald. And um, it's going to show the stitches really well. We're going to do a knit pattern. And um, it's going to be this uh, steep diagonal. And if y'all want to take, y'all want to see the sample here. So this is the sample. Let me get my, my sample ready. So it's going to be this really cool steep diagonal. So it's going to be a good good scarf um, for um, a, a man or woman. Um, I, I think it'd be a great men's scarf. Um, <clears throat> but anyway, it's really nice. I'm, I'm working up the sample. What I've done is I'm made it a chunkier version from a pattern that they had. And then that will be on their channel and you'll get to see that. And then... Um, <laughs> Amber says she doesn't remember what she put in the box. <laughs> and then um, that'll be on your inspirations later on this week. I'll be filming um, either tonight or tomorrow after I get my sample done. And then I'll be working on the pop pillow uh, from their new lookbook. So be sure and check that out. That'll be towards the end of the month. But on, it'll be on my channel. We'll be doing a pillow in the Trinity Stitch. So if you've been wanting to see me do that, uh, that will be my first project on my channel with your inspirations. So I'm excited. Is that Does that sound fun for you guys? 
So be doing a new stitch with me and then I'll be doing some stuff with uh, your inspirations and I'll be blogging about it as well. So let's get to this present because I'm dying to open it. Okay, Amber, you, did you forget what you sent me? <laughs> so I won't put her address on here, but she's from Minnesota, right? <laughs> okay, Amber Catherine. Well, she goes by Amber Catherine on there, but that's not what it says on the label. <laughs> All right, I keep, I'm keeping her label. <laughs> Yay! Here we go. Man, it always is crazy when you see how much it it co uh, like it costs to to do postage to somebody, and you're like, whoa, oh my gosh, oh my goodness. Y'all, these are carrot cakes and all kinds of goodies. Look at this. Ah, Amber. Oh my gosh. This is awesome. Wow. Wow. Oh my word. Yay. Oh, thank you so much. I haven't had this color. Lilac frosting. Ooh, look at that one. I don't have this one. Thank you. Oh my gosh, is that a second one? This is another lilac frosting. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank you. These are amazing. And there's like, oh, this one. This one is blueberry cheesecake. Mmm. Yummy. I like that. Oh, my friend Jeanette did one did a um my scarf in the blueberry cheesecake. Um, the marshmallow scarf. It looked really cute. Oh, I love this one. I think this is the macaroon one. Let's see, we're missing our label, but that's okay. I think that's what it is. Oh my gosh, that I love these colors. Aren't these beautiful? Did y'all see the new Karen Cakes colors coming out too? There's like more coming. So, oh my word, I don't, I don't have them either. Oh man, another one. Wow, look y'all, these are great. What an awesome present. I can put it in my new studio. Oh man. Oh, these are really nice. Okay, what else? These are some oh, there's some really soft stuff in here too. Oh, these are nice. Look at these balls. Oh, they're like a chenille. Like a chenille, like really soft. I think this is like I'm trying to remember which one this is. These are really cute. Oh, I love that. That'll be really great for the Embrace Grace baby stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, these are Cascade. Nice. This is, um, this one's Swaddles. I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm squishing. Me. I do that. Do y'all do that? <laughs> I do that with my yarn. <laughs> I squish it on my face to see what it feels like. Am I the only one who squishes it on their face? <laughs> Unforgettable. Unforgettable in every way. Oh, this is a good, these are good colors. This has got the, the greens and the purples in it. This is the uh, dragonfly. Really nice. Oh my gosh. What is this one? Oh, I know this one. Is this um my brain? You just call you Amber? Oh, this is so cool. I love it. I love the colors in it. This is, y'all, this is like Kristen Greens. Oh, this is so cute. I need to make like a little, um, like a little lacy scarflet or something with that. Oh, there's some more for the baby stuff. So that'll be good. Maybe a little lovey for the babies. Oh, now Amber, it looks like you started something. What did you start, girl? <laughs> I remember she had sent me some stuff saying that she wasn't able to use some of them. And so, um, that was so sweet to pass it on. Oh yeah. More, more of the unforgettable. These are great. This is a big box of yarn girl. Oh yeah. Okay. This is from loops and threads. This is, uh, denim color denim, but it's got like a lot of really good colors. And it's not just a denim color. Look at that. Isn't that nice? These are really pretty. That's soft. I haven't used this. First kiss. First kiss. First kiss. And then another really soft one. I think this is a Lion Brand one. And it's got that twist. Or is this the big twist? It's really nice. 
These are all snuggly. Yes, one has to snuggle their yarn. Let's see. Let's let's snuggle some yarn here. Here's the snuggly yarn. One, two, three. Here's the yeah, this is like this baby soft kind of mm, Hey no, I'm a little baby. So I have to test it out. If I'm a baby, am I gonna like it? <laughs> it is snuggly. It is very snuggly. Make some little mitts, little hat, little lovey. I don't know if I have enough for that, but you could do like a preemie size. Anyway, oh my gosh. Amber, thank you so much. That was amazing. There is so much in here. I can't even, I don't even know if I can fit it back in here. She's, she had it all squished in. Thank you. Thank you so much. I will, um, I will, I will be putting these in my, in my studio and, um, and working them up. And, um, and sometimes I have people come over and they want to learn. And so, um, when I have yarn donated, um, I might like teach them on that and pass it on if that's okay. If, um, if they like it, cause I like, I like to get, give people a choice when they come over to learn. I'm like, what do you like? You know, I mean, I don't want them to work with something that they don't like. Right. Um, give them something that they're just like, no, I'm not thrilled about. I love this. Oh, it's so squishy. <laughs> I have to smell it. <laughs> So I had Summer on the other day. Did y'all watch the video with Summer <laughs> Cromarty? And we were giggling and I was so crazy from lack of sleep. Y'all, I went days and days with like barely any sleep. I think I said five hours in the thing, but I'm sure I got lucky if I got five hours of sleep. And so when Mark Johnson, who comes on here so often, he was like, Kristen, are you drunk? I was really slap happy. Like I was, I was crazy. Like, uh, I had I had to be I had to have fun because I would go nutty with all that was happening. <clears throat> oh, we were funny. <laughs> it it was a lot of fun. I enjoyed her. Do you guys do you want to see Summer on again? She should she should totally come on again because it was hysterical. <laughs> so we were I felt like we were like on the road. We we're like two little comedians on the road. <laughs> so. Um, anyway, next time you see me, I will be in my studio. I promise right now I am upstairs so that I can take care of my child who is sick and I'm not feeling so hot either. So I'm sitting here in one of these like recliner chairs so that I can kick back and relax and, um, and not have to worry so much, but I'm going to just sit here and work, which is knitting on my sample for the yarn inspirations video. <laughs> so yeah, summer was great. I will definitely have to, um, to have her on again. She's, she's so fun. Um, let's see what else. Um, do y'all have any questions for me? I know I was gone for a while. Um, just to tell you, um, it was, it was really, it, it was the weirdest move because there were so many shenanigans. If you saw one of my other late night posts, um, about things that were happening with the house, but, um, I had, um, when we moved, several things were happening so much so that my husband was constantly on the phone with some vendor helping with different, all these things were happening badly. It was like, like our joy was trying to be stolen and we were having a good time and we were happy about where we were going, but there was so many, we even changed it to our chicken kitchen sink. I mean, there was so many, I mean, not the sink, the faucet and like so many other things. And so my mom, my father-in-law was working on like fixing things around the house. My husband's on the phone and I was unloading every single box and getting it in the right place and getting the kids rooms ready and my stuff ready. And like, oh my gosh. I was exhausted and this is like one of my first normal kind of days and I decided to not make it normal because my head had a migraine this morning I had to get over and my heart started acting up and but I was thankful that it didn't do it last week so I could feel that you guys were thinking about me and praying for me um, so that I was able to push through and get through it so anyway um, oh D Diana you have a new phone and you can enjoy the live videos well yay for your new phone that's fun <laughs> Oh, thank you, Brenda, for the get well soon. Yeah, Joanne, summer was hilarious. We were over the top funny. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I love her. Her humor is, like, she brings it out on me. It brings it out of me. And I say these, like, one-liners with her. And she's like, oh, I have to write that down. And, um, oh, my gosh. I, I think um, I think one of the things I had said to her was, um, like, like, just um, own your own your crazy and watch out for stairs. I think that was my last text to her. <laughs> She's like, you gotta use that line. <laughs> 
So they're like, she remembers all this. Yeah. See, I like, I, it, it escapes my brain, but, um, anyway, <laughs> she is, she is really pretty funny. Um, you going for heart surgery tomorrow, Heather? Oh my goodness. Well, my best to you. Yes. Um, I, uh, are you, are you having like a transplant or well, I guess I shouldn't ask you that, but, um, I hope everything, uh, goes well for you and, um, let me know how you're doing. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm hoping that I don't have to do any surgery. I have like a, a flow issue. And so they don't, they're trying to figure out which way it's coming from. Like if it's a good, if it's a good blow or if it needs to be addressed. And then I have like an extra heartbeat. So, um, anyway, Gala, yeah, Gala says you two fed off each other, Abbott Costello, <laughs> and that is not negative with you either. Yeah, you love the funny comedy. Yeah, she has like some dry sense of humor stuff that I kind of feed off of, and um, yeah, sometimes I don't, sometimes I don't get like dry humor, uh, but the way Summer is, it, it um, I don't know, I just, I get her. <laughs> So we have this mutual friend between us. So, so we met at Michael's, what we, we didn't talk about the thing. We met at Michael's stores when we were at the meetup for Michael Selleck for the crochet crowd. And when we got to talk and everything, we're like, oh, we got to connect. So we connected and I noticed that we had a mutual friend on Facebook and it was this person that like, if you know this person, you're like, oh, they're good. Like I can, I can trust this person. I know this person. And so it was really funny. She's like, I can't believe she's friends with you. You're friends with her. And I'm like, I can't believe you're friends with her. We have to be friends. Like, isn't that funny how that happens? So, um, <laughs> her name's Bonita. And, uh, anyway, so. <laughs> Um, I had, had to do it. Um, yeah, be well, Heather. We're wishing you, we're wishing you the best. <clears throat> we, um, oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I'm trying to scroll through. <laughs> I'm I, you know, Facebook is really funny. If I do a vertical video, I could see a whole bunch of comments. And if I do it like this, I could show more, but then I see less comments. I'm like, ah, I'm like trying to scroll through. <laughs> So now you beat an extra, t you beat an extra seven beads. Is that, did I read that right? I was trying to go back. I thought I missed something. Wow. That's wow. Cause I feel like I'm running a marathon even with the extra one. Cause what's happening is I'm like, I'm just sitting here doing nothing. And all of a sudden it's like, woohoo. And then it settles back down and woohoo. And then I feel like I've like run this race and I'm like exhausted. I'm like, I didn't do anything. Like, I wouldn't move my stitches that fast. <laughs> so I don't know what's going on. And my heart has not always been like this. So it's a little odd. So, um, but everything else checks out. So I don't know what to do. Oh, there's Mark. Kristen time. Woohoo. Mark, I mentioned you earlier that you said the other day when I was doing my broadcast, you said you thought I was drunk. And I was like, I'm high. Hi, funny. Um, yeah, I was just, I was slap happy from like no sleep. <laughs> so anyway, um, Ada, I saw you pop on sometime. So hi, <laughs> I'm so glad you're here. Anyway, it is good to see you, my friends. And, um, thank you for joining me. I'm, I'm just, I'm as plain as I can be. And I got a gray wall behind me and a black chair. So the most color is this and this, <laughs> but uh, anyway, uh, if you missed it, I opened up a really sweet package from Amber, Amber, Big hugs. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I'm going to get back to my knitting and then I'm going to go check on my daughter who is sick in the other room. <sighs> so, like, oh my gosh, girl, get better. Go to school. <laughs> anyway, um, love you all. You have a great day. Keep in touch and I will be letting you know about the next video coming out very soon. Got two coming up with Yarn Inspirations and hopefully more to come quicker than quick. All right. Love you guys. Have a great day. Happy knitting and crochet. Bye everyone.